Hello, welcome Hello. back to Ireland. <laughs> My name is Kelly. I'm 23 years old and I'm from Bunkrana. Well, a bit of a casual summer. Uh, I went to Madeira. Um, it was the best experience of my life. Um, first of all, I found out about this over uh, Facebook. One of my uh, friends at work actually tagged me in um, something because they knew I wanted to go away for the summer. Um, and first of all, it was um, something to do with a weekend in France or something for journalism students, uh, which I am. Um, and then um, I couldn't actually make the meeting, so I actually went to join the Madeira. Mm -hmm. So I went to Lerican Youth Information Centre. Um, and I was talking to Akasha, who advised, advised me what to do and um, how to go about making my application. And I had a couple of um, Skype calls and I had to send my CV and stuff um, to Madeira, uh, where I talked to some of the organisation there. And then I got the email saying that I had been accepted and I didn't really know what to expect. But uh, I definitely didn't expect to enjoy it as much as I did. Um, well, first of all, I was a tour guide, so I had to learn the history of Madeira. So I got a script and it was quite overwhelming at first. So I didn't actually think that I'd be able to learn, especially history, which was not my strong point mm -hmm. at school. Um, but uh, I had like a month to learn a script. And then it actually worked quite well. I had an exam, I passed it and I started doing tours. Um, my first tour was on uh, the Mysteries of Funchal, which is the city there. And it was just mainly about um, the monasteries and stuff like that, the churches, like the English. A very, very few Irish people over there. Um, actually, they said I was like the first Irish person to do this project. I uh, no, definitely do it. Like, don't. I was very um, skeptical about it. I was like, I don't know. It can't be as good as it says because it is, but it is as good as it says. Like, um, since I've been there, I've been welcomed over there with open arms. I have made best friends for life, honestly. Um, and all the best experience is the most beautiful place to go and it has been voted the number one Ireland or island in the world apparently no it wasn't uh difficult at all um i can i applied like in january start of february so that this time last year i was actually applying for it um it's not hard at all i uh, cash made it very easy for me to um do it and to put me at ease and like you always have support uh, here um and also you have the support over there as well so you're never going to be on your own um any problems i would text kasha i think she was tortured with me <laughs> texting all the time um but yeah i didn't i never really had that major problem um so i started at the no, i left on the 5th of july that's when i was over there at 10 o'clock at night um and then i came back on the 22nd of December just before Christmas and I think like six months is the perfect time obviously I would have stayed there but you kind of realize that it's a temporary thing when you're over there like you know it's like temporary and then you know I have more motivation to do stuff when I come back like I was quite really really sad to leave but I was also like right I know what I have to do you now I want to get my life in order mm -hmm. I want to do this this of and course this. so um so as a volunteer we get um our accommodation our bills our, our transport all paid for so we have um a 360 grant from the um actual project um that's your travel expenses so if you go under that you don't pay anything you get reimbursed for everything you um do if you have to travel anywhere due to work or because the university over there they will pay you back um so everything is reimbursed um you have, and then you also have your pocket money of i think 350 300 whatever it kind of works out depends on what we you have your meals and your uh, pocket money together so it actually works out fine but i would recommend taking uh, having a bit of money in case something goes wrong or in case you want to go home that you have some savings because i was really glad that i had my savings with me so i could enjoy there's a lot of things that you can do even though it's quite cheap over there compared to here um there's a lot of experience that you'd want to do like there's um paragliding you can do over there you have like boat trips and like sea dolphins and stuff so instead of like being like oh i have to save money i don't have enough take some money over there so you have plenty of time to experience Excellent. everything just 26 degrees just 26 just degrees not, okay major, um, no no but yeah that my friends actually texted me when i was at the airport that it was too hot to sit out they had to swim so god love them so <laughs> um no well, not really i just want to say that everyone should definitely have the opportunity to do an experience like this because you have you're only young once that you have then you have to work once you're working life and blah 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 but this is just a wee six months or whatever that you can chill out and you can enjoy yourself and you can make really good friends for life and 
it's all covered so why not thank you very much You're kelly welcome. thank you